In this video, I'm going to show you how to download Sodium for Minecraft 1.21.6. The first thing you want to do is you want to open up the Minecraft launcher like you normally would. Once you're here in the Minecraft launcher, please make sure that Java Edition is actually selected. Then in the version selector, you want to go ahead and select on latest release. Then you want to go ahead and press on play. All right, guys, once Minecraft 1.21.6 has loaded in, feel free to go ahead and close out of it. And essentially, we first need to load into Minecraft 1.21.6 before we start downloading mods and stuff to it. So go ahead and close that out once you're done with that and we can now proceed to the next step the next thing you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description down below and in the pinned comment and it is going to bring you to this website right over here where it will provide you with all the files and tools that you will need in order to download sodium and it will also provide you with a step-by-step -step guide as well anyways guys we just did step number one which was to launch minecraft 1.21.6 so step number two is to download sodium for minecraft 1.21.6 so all you want to do is underneath step two you want to go ahead and select on this download link right over here go ahead and press on that and now it is going to go ahead and open up a window that looks like this from here all you want to do is you want to make sure that versions is actually selected and from here you want to go ahead and locate minecraft version 1.21.6 so yep it is right over here and you want to make sure that fabric is also over here underneath platform so it needs to have both 1.21.6 and fabric so this one over here has both minecraft 1.21.6 and fabric so all we're going to be doing is we're going to go ahead and press on this button that says download and while that's downloading i'm going to tell you guys about simple game hosting simple game hosting offers affordable and quality minecraft servers where you're able to upload mods and mod packs with the click of a single button. In fact, Simple Game Hosting specializes in creating modded servers. So if you ever wanted to play mods with you and your friends in a server, Simple Game Hosting is the way to do so. There's dozens of video tutorials and also 24 seven live customer support at all times. If this is something you're interested in, feel free to check out the link in the description down below and in the pinned comments. All right, boys, that's enough yapping out of me. So the next thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to drag and drop the sodium fabric installer to my desktop just like so. So go ahead and do that. And then once you're done with that, feel free to go back to the original website. Now, the next thing we need to do is we need to download the Fabric Mod Loader for Minecraft 1.21.6. And essentially, Fabric is a type of mod loader that will allow us to download mods into Minecraft. So it's really important that you go ahead and download this. But anyways, guys, all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on this link that says fabricmc.net. Then it is going to go ahead and take you to a page that looks like this. From here, go ahead and select on download. Then go ahead and select on download universal jar and drag and drop it to your desktop one more time, just like this. All right, the next thing you want to do is you want to head back over to the website. And the next thing we need to do is we need to make sure that we have Java installed on our device. In order to open jar files and mod your game and download Sodium, you will need to install Java on your system. And you could do so over here underneath step number four. There is going to be a link over here. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on that. And then it is going to bring you to a page that looks like this. And you want to double check that JDK21 is actually selected. And then from here, you can go ahead and download Java for your particular operating system. So we can download it for Linux, Mac OS, or on Windows. So me personally, I'm on a Windows. So I would go ahead and select on Windows. And then I would install the X64 installer. And then all you need to do is go through the setup wizard. And downloading Java is incredible intuitive and they will also walk you through the entire process as well all right guys but if you're having troubles downloading java or it's just not working then what you may need to do is you may need to go ahead and run the jar fix the jar fix is an executable file that will basically attempt to repair all of the java files on your system so if you're running into issues go to step number five then go ahead and press on this link right over here and in my opinion it's always good to know about the jar fix just in case java gives you issues in the future and then the page is going to look something like this and all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on jarfix.exe then it is going to download a executable file on your system and all you got to do is just run it and then that will attempt to repair all of your java files and make java work on your device all right guys so now all you want to do is you want to go to your desktop where you should have the fabric installer and the sodium download all right the next thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be right clicking on the fabric installer then go ahead and select on open with and if you did download java on your system you should see this option java tm platform se binary and all you want to do is you want to go ahead and select on that then it is going to give you a pop-up that looks like this and for minecraft version please make sure that minecraft 1.21.6 is actually selected then go ahead and press on install once you're done with that go ahead and press on okay 
then go ahead and close out of it. And all you want to do is you want to open up the Minecraft launcher one more time. Once you're here, please make sure that Minecraft Java Edition is selected and then go to the top menu and press over here where it says installations. Then where it says versions, you want to make sure that modded is actually turned on because this is technically considered a modded version of Minecraft. Anyways, guys, after you're done with that, all you want to do is you want to locate the fabric loader. Then you want to go to the right and press on this folder that says open installations. Then you're going to get a bunch of folders right over here, but do not get overwhelmed because the only folder that we need to go ahead and locate is the folder called mods. Now, if for whatever reason you do not see it, feel free to go ahead and just right click anywhere, press on new and then folder, and then make sure to call it mods in all lowercase. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and open up this folder. All right. So right now this folder is empty. And from here, all you want to do is you want to go ahead and drag and drop the sodium file, the sodium fabric file right over here that we did install earlier. And all you need to do is just drag and drop it just like this. Then once you're done with that, feel free to go ahead and close out of the mods folder, head back over to the Minecraft launcher, go over here to where it says play. Make sure that in the version selector, that fabric loader 1.21.6 is actually selected. Go ahead and press on play one more time. And now just wait for Minecraft to load in. All right, guys, once you load into Minecraft, you'll now notice that it will say 1.21.6 and then fabric modded. And that is how you know you did it correctly. And now all you want to do is you want to go ahead and just load into any Minecraft world. All right, guys, and here we are in our Minecraft world. And as you're able to tell, this is actually 1.21.6. We have the happy gas over there. And if we go ahead and select on options, then go ahead and select on video settings, you will now notice that you will get the sodium menu over here, which is honestly pretty cool. If you guys found this video cool, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe as we are trying to reach 400,000 subscribers. See you later, French fries.